Two of the best young fighters on the planet, Ryan Garcia and Devin Haney, have officially announced their highly anticipated showdown set for April 20th in Las Vegas. This matchup has been years in the making with both Garcia and Haney establishing themselves among the elite at lightweight over the past few years. There's no love loss between these two as we saw yesterday when things got heated at their first official face-off. Today, I'll be giving you all the details on this mega fight, including how we got here, what each fighter brings to the table, predictions, and more. So without further ado, let's get into breaking down Ryan Garcia versus Devin Haney. Ryan Garcia and Devin Haney have a history dating back to their amateur days where they fought six times total, splitting their matchups three wins apiece. This created a heated rivalry from an early point, but both took different paths turning pro. Garcia quickly built a huge following becoming a social media star while racking up highlight reel knockouts. Haney took a more traditional path becoming the first undisputed lightweight champion in the four-belt era. They've been on a collision course over the past year as Ryan rebounded from his first loss while Haney continued his dominance. Talks heated up when Haney moved up to 140 pounds, becoming a champion once again, opening the door for this legacy fight. Yesterday, the fight became official with both fighters coming face-to-face -face in front of the media. As expected, things got heated right away, with plenty of trash talk being exchanged. Garcia got right in Haney's face, warning him he'd need to be carried out on a stretcher. Haney kept his composure firing back that Garcia was in for a reality check. After more verbal sparring, Garcia gave Haney a firm two-handed shove before they were separated. Here's the exclusive footage that shows the two fighters get physical during their face-off. Clearly, these two have genuine bad blood that will make for an emotionally charged event. This face-off set the tone that we are in for something truly special on April 20th. All right, now that we've covered the lead-up and intensity behind this matchup, let's break down each fighter's skills and attributes. We'll start with Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia, the social media superstar, boasts a record of 23-1 with 19 knockouts. He's coming off a dominant TKO victory over Oscar Duarte. Garcia possesses lighting quick hands and fight-changing power, having stopped his last six opponents. His bread and butter is the left hook which might be the fastest and heaviest in the sport today. Garcia can end a fight with a single punch, but has also shown he can box effectively when needed. The one knock is that stamina and durability are still in question after crumbling late against Gervonta Davis. Garcia clearly has all the talent to beat anyone, but does he have the gas tank to compete with Haney over 12 rounds? Devin Haney Sitting at a perfect 32-0 record with 15 KOs, Haney is a supremely skilled, well-rounded fighter. His defense is exceptional, using subtle movement and guard technique to avoid shots. Offensively, Haney throws crisp, accurate combinations behind a solid jab that often goes overlooked. While not a huge puncher, he breaks opponents down excellently with volume. Haney also possesses a very high ring IQ, making great adjustments. The biggest advantage for Haney seems to be experience and poise. He's already been in dogfights most recently against Prograis and emerged victorious. Haney won't get rattled by Garcia's antics and knows how to win big fights. This is truly a pick em type fight as both bring unique strengths to the table that could translate to victory. I believe Haney's poise, well-rounded skills and stamina give him a slight edge here. If Garcia is going to win, it will likely be by spectacular knockout in the first half. But should it go into the later rounds, I favor Haney's mastery of distance and pace to gradually wear Garcia down for a competitive but clear decision win. I just think Haney has more ways to win, and his resilience should allow him to survive Garcia's early bursts. It will be fireworks for however long it lasts, but in the end, I'm picking Devin Haney via unanimous decision. While the venue and full undercard won't be announced until next week, we do have some names rumored to feature in support. Undefeated welterweight sensation Jaron Ennis has been discussed as a possible co-main event. Ennis brings his own knockout power, making him a must-see every time out. Some other names floating around are Michael Rivera, Frank Martin, and Golden Boy prospects Sky Nicholson and Mark Castro. Of course, with a battle this massive, we can expect many more quality fights filling out the PPV card. 
I'll be sure to break those down once announced. Now, new details have surfaced after Ryan Garcia and Devin Haney's brawl. As you already saw, things got extremely heated between the fighters' camps, leading to Devin's father, Bill Haney, losing his cool. He had some very choice words and threats for Garcia's team that I need to break down for you all right now. In this video, we'll look at what exactly caused this altercation, Bill Haney's aggressive reaction, what it might mean moving forward and more. Trust me, you gotta see this. So let's break down the conflict again in detail this time. The two undefeated stars traded some verbal jabs until Ryan gave Devin a hard two-handed shove. Before anything further could escalate, Garcia's bodyguard stepped in, grabbing Haney, while someone from Devin's team held Ryan back. It was a heated moment, but over quickly, and was seen countless times in boxing face-offs. However, once backstage and away from the public eye, things reached another level between the camps. Now, footage has emerged showing Bill Haney, Devin's outspoken father and trainer, getting in the face of Garcia's team. He had to be held back by one of Ryan's larger security guards. Bill was pointing his finger, yelling things like, Take your filthy, grimy paws off me. He seemed extremely heated and ready to throw down before Kingry's squad diffused things. Later, Bill took to social media, still fuming, saying Ryan's bodyguard better keep his hands off Haney's team or he'll have to deal with Big Tank. Clearly, this was no small scuffle. So what exactly caused this wild reaction from Bill Haney? Reports indicate he was set off by Garcia's security stepping in between the fighters earlier. Bill felt it was unnecessary and took offense to be touched. He seemed to lose control of his emotions, still stewing about it despite the face-off being over. It's also fair to speculate some bad blood still lingers from Ryan and Devin's amateur days. Perhaps this brought up old feelings of seeing his son shoved. Of course, Bill has been vocal in interviews too, amping up interest, so maybe it's partly an act, but the fury seemed pretty genuine if you ask me. But while things calmed down and apologies were eventually exchanged, this altercation could hint at trouble brewing before April 20th. If Bill Haney and Garcia's team get into it again, there's potential for things to escalate beyond control. I don't think either fighter needs extra motivation, but having camps clash is never a good thing. Let's hope it was just some heat-of-the-moment emotions. But definitely, something to watch closely through the remainder of the promotion and at pre-fight events. I'd expect heavy security details to keep both sides separated because one wrong move could jeopardize this mega-fight. Safety must be priority number one, with no exceptions. Well, there you have it, folks. My complete breakdown and prediction for Ryan Garcia versus Devin Haney. This showdown on April 20th is as good as it gets in boxing. Two undefeated rising superstars meeting up in their prime. The lead-up is already intense, and you know both men will leave it all in the ring. I cannot wait for this one. But I want to hear from you. Who are you picking and why? Let me know in the comments. I hope you enjoyed the video and please smash that like button if you did. Subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay up on the latest boxing news and breakdowns. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you all on the next video.